Yeah, hello guys and welcome to another video so in this video i'll be teaching you two things first how you can add indicator on separate indicator windows and the second how to add multiple indicators on one indicator window if you're trading on the phone version of the metatrader 5 platform so let me show you what i mean by adding indicator on separate indicator windows so as you can see on your screen you see that i added three indicators on this chart First is the MACD, second is the RSI, and the third is the ADX. They are all on their own separate indicator window. MACD is on its own indicator window, followed by RSI on its own indicator window, and ADX on its own indicator window. So if you want to add probably these three indicators or more indicators in one indicator window, this is how it looks like. As you can see, I added ADX, MACD, and RSI on one single indicator window and you can see how the chart looks so whichever method you prefer to view your indicators i'll be teaching you that on this video so first let me show you how to add more than one indicators on separate indicator windows first step is to click the f icon second you select the indicator you want to add to your chart first is the macd so this is macd here i'll click on it and i'll click on the done button up there so MACD has been added. So if you want to add another indicator and you want it on a separate window, this is what you do. You click on the F button up there. Click on the F plus button on the main chart. So you click on it. Then you scroll down. I want to add uh, RSI. And this is RSI here, Relative Strength Index. I'll click down. So the RSI has been added on a separate window. If you want to add another indicator, you see repeat the process by clicking the F button first, then click on the F plus button on main chart, then select the ADX indicator, then click done. So as you can see, I have added three indicators on separate indicator window. Remember, you can adjust the size of these indicators by just click and hold any of those indicators when you click and hold this will pop up place your hand and hold on each of the horizontal line of those indicators so when it's plus and hold you can actually adjust each of them as you want if you want it smaller no problem so that is it you can actually adjust the size of this indicator so that it will give you a better view of the price action of the asset you're looking at so what if you want to add these three indicators on one indicator window how do you do that let me show you let me close all these other indicators so assuming you want to add multiple indicators on one indicator window this is what you do First, you click the F button there. Then you go to the indicator you want to add. I'll say add the same indicator I added before. First, MACD. This is MACD here. Click on it and click on the done button. So the MACD has been added. So I want to add another indicator and I want it on this window. I don't want a separate window for it. I'll see. go ahead and click on the F button up there. Then Instead of me clicking the F plus button on the main chart, I'll now click the F plus button on indicator window one. So once I do that, I'll go to the, the indicator I want to add. This is RSI. I'll click on it and I'll click down. You see that RSI has been added to the previous MACD indicator window. If I want to add another indicator on this same indicator window, this is what I'll do. I'll still repeat the same process. Click on the F button here. Then click on the F plus button beside the indicator window. Then I want to add the ADX indicator. That's the average dimensional movement index. I'll click on it. I'll click done. The three indicators have been added on a single indicator window. So this is how you can do this. It depends on which you prefer. If you want your indicators to be on one single indicator window, you already know how to do it. I've taught you that. And you want it to be on separate indicator windows. I've taught you that. You already know it. So if this video was helpful, do give it a thumbs up. And remember to subscribe to this channel if you have not yet subscribed. Talk to you in my next video.